Alright, what's going on guys and gals, and we are back for another fine edition of Sideshow Saturday. And what we got for you today is something rather different, something that could be healthy, and something that it's could be expensive. It's something epic. It's not every day that you eat a bison. Because it's epic. So, yeah, so this is by Epic Bar. Epic. Bison Uncured Bacon cr Yeah, Cranberry Bar? Is that what it says? It's basically, uh... But yeah, you can pause it and read the whole packaging, because I'm not gonna. It's basically a bison beef stick. It looks like it was 99 cents. Got and this at BB's in Newburgh. Well worth the drive, by the way. And the packaging is coming apart. So yeah, okay. so something different. It's kind of like a beef jerky, I yeah, think. If you, uh, if you live in Pennsylvania and you happen to go to uh, Sheets... And they have a, like a tiny little section by the candy bars with the health food. You'll see these things sitting there. The pro the reason why we haven't done these earlier, I've always wanted to. They are incredibly expensive. I think one of these bars might be five bucks. And how much was this whole box? Like ninety nine cents. This whole box was ninety nine cents for four of them. That's all that's in there. Yeah. Do the math. And yeah, so seven grams of protein. So. It's, it's healthy, um, made with 100% natural bison, and it's gluten-free. Have you ever had bison before? I have not. I have. It is amazing. I oh, wait, wait, wait. Yes, I have. I, I've, my parents went out west one time and bought back some, they brought back some buffalo jerky. Mm. That actually was pretty good, so yes, I have, I I have had, had a, it. I had a bison bacon, or yeah, bacon bison burger in Montana. Amazing. Honestly, you can't really tell the difference between that and beef, but bison is much healthier. It's much more expensive, too. Far more expensive. I think they sell four patty, four beef, no, four bison patties at Carnes for 13 bucks. Well, it might depend on location, too, because you, we is. don't have bison here in yeah. the east. If you go out west to Montana or South Dakota where they run Or wild, Yellowstone. They're all over Yellowstone. I'm sure you can get it for dirt cheap. But not here in Pennsylvania. Uh, it's gluten free, of course, like I just said. And it's epic. This flavorful and outrageously epic animal is an icon symbol of North America. Yeah. Yeah, when we uh, butchered all of them when we first landed here, that was iconic. For the past 10,000 years, the American bison has played a crucial role in shaping the Great Plains and nourishing the native tribes that inhabited them. As late as 1871, a single herd of bison could easily contain over one million animals and take a man six days to pass through. The white man took care of that in 1872 when we wiped the fuck out of him. Yeah! No! No! Bad! Bad! No! Anyway. As so usual, we are going to do the opening of the box test. Now we are going to do two. Oh, there's only three in here. The box lied. No, I. we had one. So, this is what they look like individually packaged. They almost look like a dog treat. <laughs> so, we'll take a close-up look at that. I just like how you, uh, you demonstrated Trump's America right there. It's like, yeah! <laughs> America! So, yeah, let's go ahead and we'll yeah, do the well, thing. Th this is what I'm talking about here. Look how big this thing is. Now, you go to Sheets and it's pay... It's thick. You go to Sheets and pay five bucks for this, I'm going to Just for ripped. that? Yeah, I'm going to feel ripped off. But nutrition, so, nutrition facts, uh, 130 calories. So it's not oh, epicbar.com. Call 512-993-4774 for concerns. So if we have, like, massive diarrhea attacks, we can call that number and call Unleash your inner animal with a bar designed as nature intended. Epicbar.com. It's only good for both land and animals that inhabit them, but also you. The consumer, when it comes to epic oh, nutrition. Best by November of 2019. It's still good. It's still good. It's freeze-dried. We're good. So, we're going to go ahead and open these bags. I think you up. open it like this. Yeah, the ridges. Jeez, do they adult-proof that shit? You have... Open up by the ridges. There, there you go. go. There you go. Oh, it actually smells good. Here, smell that. Smell it. Do you smell it's it? It's very thick. Oh, it even breaks apart easily. That's the bison. So, epic bar bison, let's try it. It's like a candy bar. Mm. 
Wow. It doesn't have the grease of like a Slim Jim. It almost, it's like it falls apart. My mommy's broken. I'll fix it. There's cranberries in there. Yeah. Daddy, I broke the one that It's okay. It's not as tough as jerky though. No, very soft. Um It's dry though, that's the problem. I think that's the biggest my biggest problem is it's very dry. Is it worth five bucks? No. 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 Get a box of them. And even then, I can't even say a box is worth it because there's only four of them in there. I'm guessing that was a serving size. Yeah, one bar. See, this is one of those things that I'm just curious about. I don't see myself really buying these. They're okay. They're different, but they're just kind of meh. Nothing really exciting about it. Took me almost dropping it. Seven second roll. <laughs> what is five the, bucks a bar. I'd be taking that shit off all the floor and still eating it. What is the rule? Is it five or seven? I in scouts I was told seven. Okay. And what? then when you get drunk, it's more like ten. All right. <laughs> yeah, you have to compensate for you know getting down. There. You have to compensate for like the lack of reaction time when you're drinking beers. When you drop a cheeseburger on the ground, you have to go, uh-oh. No, if you had, like, a whole case of beers, the rule could be maybe, I don't know, two or three minutes. Well, they have to wake you up. And they tell you, hey, you dropped a cheeseburger. Um, I'm really fancy about them. I'm not impressed. I'm really not. What do you think? They're okay. But nothing... Nothing to write home about. Nothing ever. The only thing that sticks out about it is the fact it's bison. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm. So dare I say, there's just nothing epic about it. What do you rate it? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> He's got it in his mouth. I'm chewing it. I'm just going to say, just a straight up three. I was going to say the same thing. If I have to give this any kind of rating, it's going to be as down the middle as I possibly can. Because it's not bad. I mean, bad. it didn't suck. It's not bad. But when you think of, I'm going to eat like a bison beef stick or whatever the hell we think of it is. You're thinking, man, it's going to be awesome. It was meh. That's all I can say. It was alright. I'm not going to buy it again. Now they make like chicken ones of these. They make... Are, are the chicken ones and turkey ones actually cheaper? No, probably not. But I don't even want to try that. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this epic bar review <laughs> on bison bars. There was no, nothing epic about it. So... Yeah, we'll be back next time with more Sideshow Saturday, and we'll see you later, people.